Okay. Since it's, a, since it's not your time yet now, you got to tell us, uh, what have you been working on before now? Uh, before now, well, I did my first CD. It's called What I'd Like to Say. Um, it's got 16 songs on it, all originals. Um, my old producer made most of the tracks. Uh -huh. And then, that was 2010, actually, when I did that CD. So it's been a couple years. I just recently finished recording my second album. It's called Obscure Emotion. I still have three songs to get mixed before, you know, we can go into the final process of everything. So, I've been working with John Brown, who's incredible. He's, you know, got me so that I don't sound like I'm in a tunnel. Because All right. before, when I recorded, it's like I was in a hallway all the time. Uh -huh. And now his quality and the programs he's using and his mic and everything, it's so much better. And I don't sound like I'm in a tunnel anymore. <laughs> so, that's what I'm going for. That Mariah-esque quality. Cool, She's cool. my favorite. I love Mariah. So. All right. Can, can you tell us a little about Bethany Pike? Let's see. I was as a person, as an artist, something yes. like that. I was born in Plymouth. I'm 30. Um, I don't have any children. I've been pursuing my career now for seven years. Um, I did American Idol in 2009, and they told me no. So it's kind of frustrating, but you know, you just got to keep yourself going. Uh -huh. um, last year, I auditioned for The Voice in Chicago. Uh, same story. You know, just my break yet. I moved to Atlanta for a while to try to pursue something down there. Mm -hmm. Got a lot of good shows, a lot of good pub, and um, I got to do a magazine interview uh, with this lady that uh, she saw me at a show I did, so she did an interview on me. Never got a copy of the magazine, but it's floating out there somewhere, so if you see it, let me know. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, so, so what should we expect from Bethany Pike from, I mean, for the show now first and from then on? Well, I've written over 300 songs, so I have so much work that I haven't even begun to finish yet. Um, I just want to, you know, get my music out there. I want people to hear me. It's sad that I'm stuck in Plymouth and nobody hears my music, you know? And when I get opportunities to come out and perform at any kind of festival or show or anything, I'm there. So <clears throat> whether it pays or it doesn't, referring <laughs> pays, but you know. I've done, this will be my, actually my 99th show today, so I was doing music as an artist by myself. Wow. So this will be my 99th. One more to the big 100, baby. Oh, that's so, cool. That's cool. Uh, I do weddings and birthday parties and I would do a bar mitzvah if I had to, you know. All right. <laughs> it don't matter. Um, I just love singing and I recently did a Christian song. It's called uh, I Need You More. It's not an original song, but... Uh -huh. My uh, stepdad, he plays a saxophone, so him and I did the song together, and it turned awesome. out great. And uh, my my dad is a real diehard Christian, so I wanted to make a song that he would want to listen to, and other people, you know, that don't really listen to the R&B side of my music, uh -huh. they would be, you know, still approving of, you know, doing that kind of music, and yeah, I'm never going to give up, trust me. And where, where can people find your content? You know, your video, your audio? Um, you can go to www.reverbnation.com. Bethany Pike. Um, I have, I want to say, eight snippets of my music on there. And then I have a music video, my biography. Um, you can also go to iloveplymouth.com. And I have my music on there. Uh, slash Bethany Pike, of course. Um, as a performer, I just go by just Bethany. Um, okay. Not just Bethany, but, you know, <laughs> Bethany. <laughs> and, um, let's see. What was I saying? <laughs> where, where would you find your songs? Oh, stuff? yeah, it was, um, I do have a Facebook, a music Facebook page. I recently added that. Um, 
trying to get in with the whole iTunes. We haven't really started that yet because I have to work on, you know, the masters and also the copyrights because that's, you know, always going to be an issue. I talked to uh, John about poor man's copyrights. He said those don't really fly too tough. Nah, nowadays. they don't. <laughs> so he said once it's saved in his computer as data, I'll be good. So uh, I'm just excited, you know. I'm ready for the summer. I'm ready for any shows, any opportunities that I can get, you know. Yeah, we're good. family here with me and friends to support me. That's cool. So it's going to be great. It's going to be a good show. Great, great. And we're excited for you, too. Thank and you. we're here to support your Midwest finest. Too.